Assalamu alaikum everyone. How are you all? Today I'm going to be doing a smoky eye tutorial. So let's get right into it. The first thing I'm here doing is covering my brows with the help of eye base and concealer. I'm just covering a little bit of my brows from the end making it look smaller. This is you can say a very Arab traditional style brow. I have taken a shader brush and in a dabbing motion I'm applying the base to cover them. I'm using P. Lewis Eye Base. It is one of my absolute favorite. All the products I'm using will be listed down below so you can have a look at any time. I'm also cleaning out the shape of my brows as well. So it gives me that very sharp clean brow and I will take that base and cover all of my lid so I have a clean canvas to work with. Also it will enhance the color too. Now I'm taking a black pencil and roughly just applying the color. This will also work as our base and it will make our black color really really pop. I'm just applying the color really roughly because in the end I will be blending everything out so you don't have to be very neat about it. comes the fun part I'm gonna be using Huda Beauty's rose gold palette and taking the brown shade to blend out the edges so it won't be very dark like panda eyes <laughs> and taking the black color to darken my lid as well so it will give us a great gradient color you will see as it goes out from the crease Now blending everything together and making it look flawless. So I'm doing a circular motion on my crease line here and blending everything out. The next thing I'm using here is a primerizer from Smashbox. It is a great primer and also hydrating so it's a very light formula and I love that primer. And then I'm taking a Huda Beauty's uh, Nymph highlighter. This is something that I will apply with my fingers because I've, I've tried with a sponge and a brush but it doesn't give me that kind of glow so it's easy for me to use my fingers and then I'm using on top of it is my Makeup Revolution Define and Conceal foundation which is a very good a full coverage foundation and I will be blending out with my beauty blender. And the sponge that here I'm using is the Real Techniques sponge and it is my absolute favorite. It gives me that flawless uh, finish look of my foundation and kind of like an airbrushed one but this is my favorite. I used to use a foundation brush but then I switched it to this sponge and it is like my, uh, like my favorite all time. And now here I'm using the Makeup Revolution concealer. Um, under my eyes in like a triangle shape and then all on my t-zone area and then blending it out with my same uh, real technique sponge the beauty blender and uh, it will give me you can see like a flawless look So now I'm using the translucent setting powder from Laura Mercier. This is my favorite setting powder um, it will just make my pores or my foundation look amazing and flawless after I have, I have set my face now I'm going to my under eyes and finishing that and here I'm taking the same black eyeshadow from a Huda Beauty palette and just taking a smaller shader brush and just blending that on my lower lid oh, sorry lower lash line and blending it out with a clean uh, fluffy blending brush I'm just blending everything out and making it look more flawless and also coloring and highlighting my inner corners it will just open up my eyes as well because there's too much dark colors going on so I like to highlight my inner corners and also I am taking a white concealer or a nude concealer and just 
putting it on my lower lash line and that will also open up my eyes because I've used a very dark um, black shadows to smoke it out I'm not using a black pencil or cold pencil in my um, lower lash line because it will make my make my eyes look more smaller so um, that's why I've used uh, the nude color and uh, that makes my eyes look more open and big now I've applied my false lashes and then I'm applying my mascara. I never apply my mascara on my false lashes um, because I think it just like ruins my falsies and that's why I just go ahead and apply it on my lower lashes. And then I'm taking the spoolie and just um, blending my brows because I thought it looks very dark. For my contour today, I'm using the NYX. Um, contour stick which is very kind of like a creamy stick and I love that so I'm because I'm doing a smoky eye I like to chisel my contours so that's why I'm using the cream contours um, and I'm blending it out with a brush And for my blush today, I'm using the Tarte Blush Bizarre Palette and taking that very bright, not bright, but a very nice uh, peachy pink uh, blush and just giving that color on my cheeks because everything is very muted and dark. So uh, that's why I'm just giving a color on my cheeks here. And for my lipstick today, I'm using the Huda Beauty Nude uh, Bullet Lipstick. These are my absolute favorite because these are very hydrating and just covering it up with my Tarte Lip Gloss. And for my highlighter today, I'm using the same Huda Beauty um, Highlighting Palette. Um, this is like my really nice highlighting palette, um, one of my favorites. And love that glow so here is the complete look and i hope you guys like it if you haven't subscribed to my channel please go ahead and do that and don't forget to press the bell icon for the notifications bye